everyone! My name is Karinix and welcome to my YouTube channel. So this is my very first YouTube video and what I pretty much decided to do was that I wanted it to be a August favorites. Um, a little bit about me, real quick, just a tiny bit. <laughs> um, pretty much uh, a year ago I did a YouTube channel and I didn't have no equipment and I really I still don't I'm pretty much recording this from a tablet <laughs> and so I kept holding back and holding back and I was just like how can I start a YouTube channel like you know I, I wanted to look for a hobby and I, I love being on YouTube if, you, if you're here right now and you're watching this you have an account because you also enjoy going on YouTube and so do I specifically for the beauty channels and I was like how cool would that be like I would like to do that as a hobby and so I did it and then I flaked out on the videos so it's now August of 2015 oh sorry scratch that it's now September of 2015 I started college yes I am a college student and I was like, I need a hobby. I, I need something to do. I work, you know, and I go to school. And I live far from where I grew up. I live in Binghamton, New York. And I grew up in New York City, in Manhattan, New York. And so all my friends and family live out there. And I still, I know a lot, of, I know people here. I've been living in Binghamton for two years now. And I know people up here, but not like I know everyone back home and so you know that's always gonna be home no matter where I go like this is where I live now but that's always gonna be home but anyways um, I'm trying to like open up and get more familiar with things like with the area and make new friends and, and all that fun stuff and so I was like let me just start you know let me just start <laughs> so here I am <laughs> okay so for August favorites let's start with makeup because a lot of my channel is gonna be about makeup um, just to make something clear I'm not in any way shape or form a beauty expert I'm not a beauty guru I don't know if I will anytime soon do tutorials I I know how to do my own makeup I don't freelance I I don't work for the makeup industry this is just something that I'm doing for fun you know this is my YouTube channel related to beauty that I'm doing for fun you know so I'm actually an education major so I want to be a teacher but ever since I can remember um, I love makeup <laughs> I love anything feminine you know, the dressing, the makeup, the clothes, the bags. You know, I know. If you're watching this, you know, you understand. So, yeah. And it says it on my on my um, page, on my banner. You know, pretty much what it's about. It's going to be about inner and outer beauty. Of course, outer beauty, but inner beauty. I'm very big on that. Um, my life journey and love because love is love and I love love. <laughs> And I'm a big believer in that. So, yeah, a lot of that, you know, not just, not just like boy girl love or girl girl love or boy boy love, like love in general, like loving the earth and loving children and loving makeup. Oh yeah, loving makeup. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. August favorites. Can you believe it's September? Because, wow, we're in September. Literally, we're in September. Like, I remember my birthday like it was yesterday. My birthday's in January, by the way. I remember it like it was yesterday. Like, I remember ordering one of my August favorites that I used all of August. I used it back in, I bought it back in January for my birthday at Ulta. And, which I'm, I guess I'll start with that. The Tartlet Palette. Oh my gosh. Look at this, look at this. Oh. Isn't it beautiful? I love it, guys. Guys, guys, guys. Look. Okay. 
Hold on, hold on. Let's see if I can get this here. Look at that. Uh, let's do this pinky. Look at that. And my favorite, which is called Force of Nature. Oh, yes. Beautiful. This was, I believe... How much was it? I'm not sure. I think... I think it was around 49 bucks, but because it was my birthday, I paid $44 for it. Uh, maybe a little less. I don't know. I'll double check, but I will link it down below. They still have it at Ulta and Sephora. Um, creamy, creamy, creamy. Oh, I can't. Creamy, creamy, creamy. See that? Creamy. Um, I love the packaging. It's very cute. Tart. I love it guys it's it's just the perfect neutral colors and they just go so smoothly they blend so smoothly yes yes I love it I used it so much I had it since January but August and now in September said so I'm really like digging into it like love it yes all right oh next item I think that's the only eye product, so let's stick to eye product. No, I have one more. Okay. ColourPop Eyeshadow in Tassel. Ladies and gentlemen, this thing is bomb.com. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. When I first got it, um, I don't... What I like about ColourPop, mostly is their super shock shadows the like the glittery ones like this one i love them because they're so pretty now i don't use glittery eyeshadows that much but the color pop like glittery eyeshadows the super shock shadows there's something about them that makes it wearable and i love that but this particular one actually let me swatch it this particular one i couldn't find a way that I can wear it until I saw, um, what's her name? Beauty by Rosita, Rosita Applebaum, here on YouTube. Um, she would use it in the inner corner all the time. And I'm just like, okay, I'm gonna have to try that. Once I tried that, guys, oh my gosh, change changes your life. Literally changes your life. I love it. That's all I use it for. All I use it for. You just put it right here in the inner corners. Beautiful. Like, it works. Like, thank you, Rosita Applebaum. You are the bomb.com because, seriously, the best. I'm going to show you right there. You see that? You see that? Oh, yes. That is Tasso from ColourPop. And another great thing about ColourPop is that they are affordable. $5 for this. Five dollars for this beautiful little thing. <laughs> All right, sticking to ColourPop, let's go on to cheeks, guys. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I need a napkin. Look, I need a napkin. All right, I'll be back. Okay, I didn't want to go too far. <laughs> So I just grabbed my towel. Ah. Anyways, I didn't want to go too far. Okay. Now let's move on to cheeks. For August, highlighters. Highlighters, yes! <laughs> so I never thought I would like highlighters. I love it. I love it. I mean, I'm just wearing... You see that? It's just... Uh, isn't that pretty? Like, how can you not like highlighter? How can you, like, not like... When you move your face, yes. Jaclyn Hill is the queen of highlights. Love her. Love her. Love her. <laughs> but let's stick to ColourPop real quick. Oh, it's black. It won't come off. Anyways, ColourPop um, highlighter in the shade Wisp. Guys, this is beautiful beautiful when ColourPop first launched their highlighters this is the only one I have I want to get more but this is the only one I have and I was 
doing my research, of course, on YouTube and Instagram and all that fun stuff, checking the reviews. I, you just, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. I think, I think Kathleen Lights mentioned it either last month or this month. I don't know. And one of her favorites, I think so. And I was like, I know, I know it's good. I was like, I have it, I have it. You know, like obviously to myself, like if I knew Kathleen Lights, oh my God, I would, yes. <laughs> I've gotten all of her things, by the way. I got her new um, liquid lipstick with Ofra Cosmetics Miami Fever. And I have her quad with ColourPop and um, a lipstick from that she collaborated with ColourPop. I'm pretty sure you know it's, I'm going to feature it here. Yes, that's how much I love that girl. Yes, she's just bomb.com. Look at this highlighter. Do you see that? Do you see that gold? Oh my gosh. Beautiful, right? beautiful and it's so it's like a i don't know it's like a you see that it leaves like it leaves my it's like a like a mousse texture that's i really like that about ColourPop. that their eyeshadows are like moussey and it's scary at the same time though because it's like oh my gosh what brush do i use for it your fingers is the best one and a synthetic brush they say it I also like that like when you buy a when you buy a package from ColourPop when you make an order you get your package they send like tips and tricks on how to use their products yes oh you see that I have shadow everywhere that's how pigmented that black shade is from um tartlet 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 that one right there that's what you keep seeing on my fingers it's all pigmented anyways so, now, back on cheeks. Was that the only No, there was one more highlighter. Okay. This is Hard Candy Bronzer, but obviously that's not a bronzer <laughs> because that's all I have on my cheeks. This is the Tiki Bronzer, Big Bronzer from Hard Candy. It's a highlight, guys. It's a highlight. Like, this highlight highlight on fleek like Jaclyn Hill says you see that you see that that's not a that's not a bronzer that's a highlight love it love it oh yeah I forgot to mention well it's my first time this is my first YouTube video and it's gonna be my first time in this whole editing thing and linking things so I'm gonna try my best my hardest to like write down the prices or link stuff so you guys can find it um you guys have only have two subscribers <laughs> and those are my family members family don't they love you they love you family loves you they'll do anything for you but yeah eight dollars this highlight eight dollars color pop super affordable i love it okay two more cheap products and then we'll move on and then okay <laughs> guys I'm pretty sure I've had these two blushes that I'm gonna mention really quick um, since before uh, everyone started raving about it on YouTube and, and I think on Instagram yeah for a while and I'm very happy that everyone's raving about it because they're that good when I first got them I'm like why isn't anybody going crazy over these blushes? Seriously, they're insane. But then again, it was like not summer yet. So, you know, it's not a summer shade. Even though there's no rules on makeup. Wear whatever you want, whenever you want. <laughs> okay, ready? Milani Rose de Oro and Milani what is this shade oh yeah <laughs> luminoso luminoso rose de oro god life changers life changers this one beautiful beautiful it it's like a blush bronzer highlight all in one all in one i'm going to swatch it 
side by side. You see that? You see that? You can't really see it. I'm a starter, so I don't have the best equipment, guys. <laughs> so work with me. Do you see that? I know, you can hardly see it, but I swear this camera, this tablet is not giving it justice. Let's try to swatch um, Luminoso right next to it. Okay. That's Rose de Oro, and that's Luminoso. So yeah, they're definitely summer shades, or... Oh, they're definitely targeted more for summer, um, more appropriate for summer, but I wear it whenever I want, and it works. <laughs> so it's okay. You're not limited to a certain season. But yeah, Rosto Oro, Luminoso, Milani, Drugstore. Yes. Yes. Next. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, I thought I had more face products, but, or at least cheek products, but I don't, I'm done. Okay, so face, another face, well, one face product, I think that's it, just one. Ready? Infallible Pro Matte. If you haven't heard about this by some beauty guru, yes, that's all I can say is yes. I have oily skin and I tend to have oily skin right here my t-zone I don't know if the t-zone's upside down or upside yeah upside right upside up I don't I don't even know what I'm saying anyways this is my oily area that and I have oily lids too which I just realized I'm like what's wrong with my eyelids and it wasn't until the summer where I was sweating balls Yes, false. That I realized, oh my gosh, every time I like looked in the mirror, this was shiny and I had nothing on. Like when I didn't have any eyeshadow or primer or anything, this was oily. And when I did, this was oily. So, yeah, um, I have oily lids too. The perfect foundation. This is not my only foundation, but this is the only foundation that literally I wore it to school today. So I did my makeup. At 7 in the morning, it is 3.51, and the only thing that you see is my highlight. That is my highlight. I'm not shiny. Whatever you see shiny is legitimately my highlight. This is amazing, and I did not have to set it. I did not have to set it at all. At all, I didn't have to set it, and I didn't even put a primer with it. I did not prime my face today, and... It's, I don't know, it's like, it's almost as if, as the day goes, but like, it's great when you put it on, and you can tell, it really is, and, and I think it's because it's semi-matte, it's not a fully matte foundation, and by the way, sorry, I'm in the shade 103 Natural Buff, so, that's my shade, um, maybe it's because it's semi-matte, I don't know, but it really... You know, I haven't done the whole 24 hour because it says up to 24 hour foundation. I don't know if that's true. You know, a lot of the beauty community will guarantee that it's like an all day thing. Um, but for me so far, so good. I'm not oily. And almost, I think all of my other foundations and I have matte foundations and I put on a matte primer and I'll still get oily. This does not allow for me to get oily. Worth your money, worth it. Like, worth it, the best thing. Good job, L'Oreal. <laughs> okay, now let's get into lips. Yes, lips, 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 lips. Okay, <laughs> let's talk about uh, lip gloss. You know, or a lip balm, lip gloss, lip whatever. Let's start with that. I have here this Victoria's Secret. Um, it's they, they call it the tinted lip balm. 
I got this for like eight bucks at Victoria's Secret. Guys, it's what I have on my lips right now. It's what I have on. That really shiny stuff. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you. Um, I have Luminoso on my cheeks today. And then I have um, the Hard Candy Tiki Highlight on my whatever. But yeah, it's what I have on my lips today. I mean, like all the products that I'm featuring are on my face. But it's because it's my go-to, you know? I, like... It's just, it's when I'm, when I just want to get out the house, but I want a nice fresh face, that's, it's, you know, Luminoso, Tiki, Balm, and Mascara, and that's pretty much it. I don't even bother in doing my eyebrows. I don't have anything. I just, you know, my quick, quick, fresh face to go, to get out the house <laughs> and look presentable at least. But yeah, it smells like, like mint. It smells like mint. It's pink, my favorite color. Yes. <laughs> and it has glitter love it love it love it yes good for like every day you know and it's very soothing i don't think it's tinted at all it doesn't i don't think it's tinted but it definitely smells good and it's not sticky mm -mm. not sticky it smells good i like the glitter and i like that it's pink now ready a matte lipstick this one's from ColourPop as well, and it's $5. Very inexpensive. And Kathleen Lights created it, which I love even more because I love Kathleen Lights. <laughs> I love her. I really do love Kathleen Lights, guys. This is the shade she created with ColourPop. Very, like, appropriate for this season now, coming up fall season. It's the perfect, like, mauve. And that's the only way. And, guys, it smells like chocolate. It smells like chocolate. But yeah, you see that? Beautiful. Beautiful. I love it. Beautiful. She did a really good job. Creamy. It's matte. It doesn't budge. It stays. Great. More ColourPop. I know. I know. But that's how much I love ColourPop. Because, hello, I live on my own with my boyfriend. I'm a college student. I pay bills. I have rent. So... I need good, inexpensive stuff, but if I have to pay a couple of bucks for expensive, good product, I'm going to do that too because I like to pay good amount of money for a good product that's going to be worth it. Now, I don't like paying a lot of money for something that's going to be crap. No one does. But yeah, <laughs> these are the ColourPop liquid lipsticks. Yes! I'm in that whole liquid lipstick trend. Yes. Yes. Amazing. Amazing. They stay on all day. You do have to exfoliate. You do have to exfoliate. Like if you don't if you don't have um naturally soft lips or whatever, exfoliate. You want to get all like those dry things on your lips off before you, you put any liquid lipstick on if you want it to have a nice smooth and pretty application so that's that that's the one tip i have to say because that's you know that's what i like to do or prime or primer lips just prime it my favorite color guys let's start with my favorite color bumble this is bumble i'm gonna swatch them of course i'm gonna swatch them um i mean Oh my gosh. Just beautiful. Literally. It's be it's I don't it's like a You see that? It's like a terracotta. It's like a terracotta, right? Like like uh I don't know what they describe it in the website. But to me it's like a pinky brown orange. I don't know, like a pinky brown orange. I don't know. I'm probably giving like a horrible color description. Horrible, horrible. But I love it. Now the next one. The only the only thing that happened to me. To, I don't know if it happened to anyone else, but I don't care. I still used it. I, I'm still buying another one of the same color when I ran when I run out because it's beautiful. But I think it was just this one with Clueless when I opened it. It leaked, but then afterwards it stopped leaking. So I think it, I probably did something. I don't know. This is the color Clueless. So pretty. It's like a lighter version of Lumiere. 
See, that's Clueless, that's Bumble, and that's Lumiere. So it's like a little lighter than Lumiere. And then my favorite that I can't wait to like, it starts getting more into fall so I can wear this color because I still feel like it's still summer, you know? At least here in Binghamton today, it was like 90 freaking one degrees. Oh, I was so upset. But yeah, it was like 91 degrees, and tomorrow's supposed to be 95. And I was just like, why can just winter come already? I don't know. Even though a lot of like the Binghamton folks are like, no, we need sun out here, summer. <laughs> but I like winter, so maybe it's because I was born in January. I don't know. <gasps> Guys, do you see that? Do you see how pretty is that color? It's called Avenue. Avenue. See, I'm giving them thumbs up. <laughs> Avenue from ColourPop. Beautiful. It's beautiful. I love it. Seriously. It's amazing. So, yeah. So, those were my makeup. Well, no. I still have some more makeup products, but, like, my lip products. Now. Mascara. I've had these for a while. The Loric. Oh, someone's calling me. Hold on. Babe, I'm filming. Sorry, love you. Yeah, it's not on, but <laughs> when he sees this, he'll know. <laughs> Anyways, sorry. Okay. L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. Oh. This thing, I love it. It's what I have. Let me see if I can get closer. Do you see? Do you, do you see? Can you see it? Can you see it? <laughs> I look like a weirdo, but this and this one, the Lorac, the oh, uh, the Lorac Pro Mascara, yes, <laughs> amazing, amazing. I love them. I love them. This one really does give you the best volume, and I don't know this like the Lorac Pro. It just spreads them out. Like I put the Lorac Pro first. And then this just gives it the volume that I want and like the blackness. Good, 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 good. Okay, now let's go into. Ta da! This is the Real Techniques. I really like Real Techniques. This is their sponge, the one with like the little flags. Dirty. I have to clean it, I know. But I really love this. I have not. Um, purchase the beauty blender I'm dying to purchase it to see the difference um, but I still haven't purchased it guys I would really like to but I love this and if it's anything like this yay and if it's better then yay you know it's worth your money but I love this sponge I love the flat like this flat part and I get it like right under my eyes like to set my concealer and then of course I use like the wide fat, fatter parts and um, of the Real Technique sponge to put my foundation. That's what I use to put my foundation, my concealer, and, and not to set it, sorry, to put my concealer and to put my foundation. I don't set with the sponge, I set with a brush. So that's that. On the Real Techniques wagon, I love this brush. This is the Real Techniques sculpting brush. This is perfect. This is what I use to bronze. You see how it's like slanted? You see that? And then like I don't I don't know. I I just I love the fact that it's slanted and it's super super soft, guys, like super soft. And I just just like that and I, you know, like go back and forth and back and forth and really good. Real techniques. You can get this in Ulta. You can get this, I believe in Walmart. Yeah, I got this in Walmart. Yeah, I got this in Walmart. So, Ulta, Walmart, Realtechniques.com, Drugstore.com, you know, all those good stuff. And then this is the Real Techniques setting brush. But, I don't use this to set my concealer. I use this for highlight. Why? Because it's small enough that, I don't know, I just, this is what I use for my highlight. And I just, you know... A little button nose. <laughs> but I use this for highlight. I love it. It's small. It's precise. It gets right in my little area. And that's what I use it for. I use a different... I use an elf brush for um, setting my concealer. But I haven't been using it 
that much this month so obviously I'm not gonna put it and lastly my blush brush this is from BH Cosmetics BH Cosmetics oh upside down BH Cosmetics and this comes with a kit I'll list it down below but love this this just I don't know I don't know what is it but I guess because it's like so rounded and like just so fluffy that when I apply my um when I apply my my blush it, it like blends everything out and I like that I like the application I like how it goes onto my face on my cheeks and I'm putting it on but it's blending it out so it doesn't look like that harsh blush in one spot it just looks evenly distributed onto my cheeks I love that okay we're getting last to our last four products and these are not necessarily cosmetics but it's okay because it's not all about cosmetics <laughs> Well, it's still a little related to cosmetics, at least this one, the first one that I'm going to start with, but not entirely. <laughs> this is the Clinique, what is it? Take the Day Off Cleansing Milk. My mom got me this. Mom, love you. This is awesome. I needed a makeup remover. I was using the e.l.f. one, and I really like it, but it seemed to be breaking me out, or... I guess I have sensitive skin. I still haven't determined what kind of, if I have sensitive skin or not. I know I have oily skin, but I don't know. I think I do because I tend to break out with certain things. So that's sensitive skin, right? I don't know. <laughs> but after I use this to remove my um, makeup, oh, guys, smooth. No, no little bumps. You know, the e.l.f. one, and I want to love it because it's so affordable. And, you know, when um, I really couldn't afford makeup, that's all I used to buy. So, I used to take it out. I was like, I don't have money, so I need to use this. And I would get little bumps. But now, Mom, thank you so much. Now I'm going to save up my little pennies and dimes, you know, working here and stuff for books and, and for Clinique makeup remover. <laughs> so, yeah. Yes, this is good. I'll link it down below. Okay. Perfume. The pink, what is it called? Purple Iris and Amber All Over Mist. Beautiful. Love this. Guys, so good. All over, hair, body, everything, anything. This is good for school. Um, for those of you in high school, those of you in college, if you have a gym class, whatever, I don't know if they have showers in your, if they don't have showers in your high school or your gym, or whatever the case may be, if you're going to the gym and you just want to smell good, you don't have time to shower, all over mist. It smells bomb. Really love this. What is it again? Amber and purple iris. I know what amber is. I think purple iris is a flower. I need to double check. Secondly... A candle that my friend Maria got me. Maria, I I told her she got it for me, and I'm like, this smells delicious. This sh I think she got it at TJ Maxx. Um, she did get it at TJ Maxx. It's from that brand that they sell, DW Home, DW Home, and the flavor for this is called Sunset Cove. Very floral, aromatic, and just it just I turn it on, and me and my boyfriend are just like so relaxed and happy i definitely will check my local tj maxx because this is very good yes <laughs> and lastly for college or for daily life for work whatever the case may be guys um this lily pulitzer journal no not journal sorry lily pulitzer i hope i'm pronouncing her last name right uh agenda 2015 through August 2015 through December 2016 agenda that's awesome that's amazing that's the first thing that I loved about it but it's really cute you see Ooh, super cute and it has like all the way till December 2016 love it it's really cute has some stickers this is a folder here are the stickers. And then let's see if I can show you a calendar. See? It's really cute. I love it. And then you can, like, do notes every day. See, what does it say here? Thursday 17th, first quiz for 8 a.m. sociology class. Ooh, sociology. <laughs> but, yeah. 
So that was all, guys. That was all for the month of August. Those were all my August favorites. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you stick around, and you liked my channel, and you liked my personality, or something about you that clicked with me. And if you do, guys, please comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.